And the winner for the most surprising, most fun, and wow Oscar special goes to... I'd like to thank the Academy. <laughs> Katie's Just Mad About Oscar, Wednesday at 10 on ABC. Hello to our fans online, I'm Rob Nelson. And I'm Diana Perez with the top stories of this Monday, February 18th. Tragic news about the troubled country star singer Mindy McCready. Police say McCready took her own life yesterday afternoon at her home in Arkansas. Her body was found on the front porch with a single bullet to the head. McCready had been on the top of the country charts since the mid-90s until personal problems derailed her career. Just last month, her boyfriend died under mysterious circumstances and McCready entered rehab. McCready was 37 years old. She leaves behind two young children. Also, we are learning new details about the Newtown shooter, Adam Lanza. A new investigation by PBS and the Hartford Current finds that Lanza was diagnosed with a sensory disorder, was very shy, and liked being touched only by his mother. As for the exposure to guns, friends say Lanza's mother, Nancy, loved shooting because it helped her bond with her son. Democrats and Republicans are warning President Obama not to go at it alone when it comes to immigration reform. That warning comes after a White House proposal on immigration was leaked over the weekend. A spokesman says the proposal is meant only as a backup in case lawmakers on Capitol Hill cannot reach an agreement. And an unlikely reunion in Chicago over the weekend. Former heavyweight champ Evander Holyfield was promoting a new barbecue sauce at a super supermarket when his formal rival, that's right, Iron Mike Tyson, randomly showed up. Back in 1997, they weren't so buddy-buddy. Uh, that's when Tyson infamously bit off a piece of Holyfield's ear during a bout. Tyson said the incident has, though, become a positive since then because of the love and forgiveness that's involved. I don't know that I'd ever be comfortable hugging a man that bit off my ear. <laughs> Mike, Mike has evolved over the years. He's a very sensitive man. He's back. He's doing just fine. He's very good. Mike's fine. He's growing. He's very good. Very good. Oh, my God. I would say that to his face. <laughs> Love you, Mike. <laughs> you can get more news anytime at abcnews.com. Oh I'm Rob Nelson. And I'm Diana Perez. Thanks for watching. Sorry, Mike. <laughs> Sorry. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. Hey, Robin, this your boy Dwight Howard. I am so happy to see you back on TV. I got nothing but love for you, baby. Nothing but love. This Wednesday, Robin's back on GMA.